Howdy, cowboys and cowgirls. It's me, Cowboy Jack. Today, I'm super pumped. We're coming at you from North Carolina. Not just anywhere, though. Check out where we're at. That's right, we're at Scott Farms. You know, what do farmers do when they grow the best sweet potatoes in the world right here in North Carolina? They have to bring them somewhere to get them from the farm to your table, and that's exactly what they do here. I've heard about some really cool equipment. Y'all wanna go check it out? Come on, let's go. Wow, check out this place. Oh, hey, how's it going? Hi. Hi, I'm Cowboy Jack. I'm Lindsay, welcome to our farm. Miss Lindsay, this place looks incredible and I heard y'all do some really cool things. Yes, we do. Here at Scott Farms, we love North Carolina sweet potatoes. Well, who doesn't? They're the best sweet potatoes in the entire world. That's right. So what do you guys do with those sweet potatoes? So here we grow, pack, and ship our sweet potatoes all over the country and all over the world. I bet that takes like some pretty big equipment and stuff, doesn't it? It does. Do you think there's any way we could check that out because it sounds so cool. Absolutely, let's go. All right, let's go. Wow, Miss Lindsay, what is this huge place? So this is one of our many storage rooms for sweet potatoes that we have here at the farm. And what they do is they stay in these bins until they're ready to go get washed and put in boxes. This is enormous. I mean, how many sweet potatoes can you fit in here? We can fit about 28,000 bins in on site at our facility. Did you hear that? 28,000 bins? Oh my God. <laughs> that is absolutely crazy. So from here you take them to get... Yes. To from get. here we take our sweet potatoes over to our facility, we wash them and then we pack them in boxes so they can go to the grocery store and you can eat them. That is so cool guys, this is incredible. Can, can we see that? Absolutely, let's go. All right, let's do it. Wow, so Miss Lindsay, what is this giant thing? So right now we are looking at the dump tank. The so when, dump tank? Yes, when sweet potatoes come in from the field, they're very dirty. So before we take them inside and pack them in boxes, we have to wash them off in the dump tank. Okay, can we take a look? Absolutely. All right, let's do it. Wow, so these potatoes are literally just being washed. That's right. They go all the way, they start over here and get washed and move this way? They go that way. Oh, okay, they're going into the building this way. That's right. That is so cool. Wow, and all these sweet potatoes come in fresh from the fields, covered in dirt. They're washing them off, get them inside to package them up. This is so fun. Lindsay, what is, what's happening here? So this is the first step the potatoes go through after they're washed. They come through the eliminator table where we pick off these ugly strings and they can start looking pretty. Just like this? Good work. Look at that. <laughs> Back down the line you go. That's right. That is so cool. And so it just keeps on going. Yep, they're gonna go up to the mechanical sizer, which is the next step in the process. Mechanical sizer, that sounds pretty cool. Yeah, it's Wait, awesome. Can we check that out too? You can. Guys, we're gonna see everything here. This is so cool, let's go. Wow, so they come up here and this is the mechanical sizer? So this over here is the mechanical sizer and what you'll see is each lane is for a different size sweet potato. That's so cool. I mean, technology plays a huge role in your operation. It does. It plays a very big role. Wow, look at those sweet potatoes rolling down the line. Wow, guys, look, there's even more conveyor belts. This is crazy. And you can kind of see it better right here. So as the wheels turn, the smaller potatoes will fall out here and the big potatoes will fall out later. Oh, that makes so much sense. So as they fall out, they're going onto this conveyor and just being sorted differently. That's right. And as they move through the line, the exeter will take a picture of them and it's it tells them what size the potato is 
and it drops it off on the line that corresponds with that size. Guys, this facility, I mean, what we're doing is we're sorting sweet potatoes, right? But I just heard we're using computers, we're using science, we're using gravity and physics, all kinds of different things. This is so educational and it's good for our food. That's right. Wow, so this is where they fall once they come out of the sorter. That's right. Small potatoes at the end, medium potatoes in the middle, and big potatoes down here. This is so cool. Miss Lindsay, I think I'm looking at a sweet potato racetrack. <laughs> uh, hey, that's close. Basically, this big blue box that you see is right a computer. There. That's right. It's a really smart computer, and it takes a picture of every sweet potato that comes into the building. Wow. And the picture tells the machine what size the potato is. Then the machine knows which line to drop each potato at based on the size of the sweet potato. That is absolutely incredible. And if you watch long enough, you'll see sweet potatoes get knocked off of the line. And I'm assuming that's using hydraulics to push them off. That's right. Or pneumatics, one of the two. But this is so cool. You have so many different processes happening all at the same time, all to get that sweet potato from the farm to your table. Now, Miss Lindsay, there's a lot of folks working really hard here. This looks incredible. What are they doing? So basically, these amazing employees are manually sorting sweet potatoes, and they are the last line of defense before a sweet potato goes into a box. They are making sure that every sweet potato that goes into a box is perfect. That is so cool. It's like man and machine working hand in hand together. That's right. You guys are doing awesome. Good job. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Awesome. So as they fall on the blue line, you can kind of see right here, they're falling into a box. That box, oh, okay. yep, the box is on a scale for 40 pounds. Once the box is 40 pounds, it's done and it drops it and releases it down to the tape machine and the box is ready to go. That is so cool. And I noticed it got tagged as it's rolling. Yep. Everything is so like, oh, it's just so amazing. Look at those beautiful sweet potatoes rolling on down the line. And these machines are so smart, they can even tell when there's going to be a sweet potato traffic jam. If you notice, those two boxes never hit each other. They know exactly how to roll out. Here comes another one. Wow, now from here, it looks like they go a long ways. Where are they headed from here? So, after they go through the tape machine and they're all taped up, they will go up the spiral ramp. And if you follow them across the building, they go upstairs to our box storage area. After they sit in the box storage area, they go to the palletizer, which I'll show y'all next. So like, would you say we're about halfway done in the process? We're about halfway, yeah. Guys, my head is spinning. I've seen all these incredible machines. I've seen all these incredible people doing really hard work. We've only covered about half. Let's keep moving. Guys, we're going right towards the spiral staircase of sweet potatoes. It's gonna be so cool to look at. This is where they take them up to the storage area until they're palletized. Let's watch this box right here. Here it comes, green and orange. Let's watch this one go all the way up.
All right, guys, he's almost at the top. Look, you see him up there? There he is. Now he's gonna go all the way down this whole building up into the storage area. Wow, so this is the, what do you call this? This is the wrap machine. After all of the boxes are stacked on a pallet, it comes into the cage where it's plastic wrapped. So they will stay nice and tight when they get on the truck. Oh, you said wrap machine. I thought this is where Snoop Dogg hung out. <laughs> <laughs> wow, guys, look at that wrapper right there. Wow, so I noticed it went all the way up one direction and now it's candy caning back down. That's right. I guess you have to keep these things pretty stable because you're moving them around with forklifts and all those things. Yep, and you definitely do not want them to fall once they're on the truck. I bet not. I mean, that, you talk about a sweet potato mess. Look at that, it just clean cut that, that plastic wrap. That is so cool. <laughs> I just cannot get enough of the science and all the computer and technology that goes into these. Boy, I bet you could have a hundred different career paths and end up applying that knowledge right here at Scott Farm. That's right, and we have a lot of very smart people who do a lot of different jobs and we're very thankful. That is so cool. Well, Miss Lindsay, what do I have here? So right here, you have one of my favorite Scott Farms products. It is steam bag potatoes. These potatoes, they're a little bit smaller. If you pop this bag straight into your microwave, they are gonna heat up in just a few minutes and they make perfectly cooked, soft, sweet potatoes. That is so cool, guys. This is like what you see at your local supermarket and we're seeing how they package it right here. Let me get that back on the line so it can get to your house. <laughs> That is so amazing. And so all this is done by hand right here. Yep. That is so cool. I just can't stop, guys. Sweet potatoes are so incredible. So many of it comes right here from North Carolina and especially Scott Farm. This is great. Look at all those beauties. Wow, it feels amazing in here. This is a super cool room. Like, it's also cool, but it feels cool. Yeah. So, so what's going on in here? So this is our cooler. This is where we store all of our sweet potatoes before they get on the truck to go to the grocery store. And when we are completely full, we can have 20 loads of sweet potatoes in here. 20 loads of sweet potatoes. That's a whole lot of sweet potatoes, but look how huge this is. I see pallet upon pallet upon pallet of sweet potatoes all over the place in here. This is crazy big. And this like, you might see your grocery store unloading these onto the shelves, not onto the shelves, but taking this box, cutting it open, stacking them in the produce aisle, that kind of thing. I mean, this should be hitting very close to home. This is what you would see at your local store, whether that's an HEB, Piggly Wiggly, even one of the Food Lion stores. There's so many different grocery stores, but they all, if they know what they're doing, they're getting these wonderful, amazing North Carolina sweet potatoes.
Wow, cowboys and cowgirls, what an incredible time we had right here at Scott Farms. And Miss Lindsay, thank you so much for this tour. That was an absolute pleasure. And we've got so many incredible folks here with us. The North Carolina Sweet Potato Commission. We've got everybody here all pitching in to bring sweet potatoes right from the farm to your home, wherever it is you live, because this is literally worldwide and they're the best sweet potatoes ever. So until we see, wait, wait, wait. Can you guys help me with the yeehaw? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, let's give them a good yeehaw right here from North Carolina, where the best sweet potatoes are from. All right, guys, until we see you next time, one, two, three. Yeehaw! Yeehaw!